Well, Danny, let's talk about that performance. First half, you go in 0 0, and then by the end of the game, it's 4 0. Yeah, it was a, a really good performance. Proud of the boys. It's, it's been a really good week for us. I think, you know, you go back to Oxford last Saturday and the amount of effort um, the boys put into that game without the walls. I thought, you know, they've, they've, they've bounced back from that. Um, showed showed real character this week. Got a really good result against Burton. Um, hard fought first half. Didn't have a great way in. Um, didn't quite get the get the game plan to, to 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 where we wanted it to be. But I thought we finished the first half stronger. And really, the message at half time was just to free us up a little bit more. Um, try to play with a little bit more freedom, a bit more courage. Um, and I thought we did that second half, and that allowed us to find a rhythm. Um, and then we got the first goal and once we got the second goal you started to see the confidence and you know, I think we showed that we can be a really good team at this level. The first goal in Pompey Colours for Aidan O'Brien as well. Yeah, yeah, really good introduction for, for him. Um, I think with his first touch, um, great play by Marcus and Ronan down the right and we knew going into today's game that if we could get into advanced areas and get lots of crosses into the box, that we could be a real threat against Doncaster. It's how they've conceded a lot of goals, and, and yes, yeah, so it proved. And of course, two and two for Sean Raggett. That's one less goal that he owes you now. Absolutely, yeah. I'm pleased he's he's got going. Um, this a set piece delivery has been been significantly better in the last two games, and and now we've looked a real threat, which is which is great to see. And let's talk about your starting lineup today. Three changes. Just tell us why those uh, changes were made. Just, I think, just to freshen it out. We've had a really tough week. Obviously, when you play the, the the two games against Oxford and put the energy that we did in last Saturday, almost 90 minutes against ten, uh, with 10 men, um, and then again on Tuesday night, I thought it was just the right thing to do to freshen it out. We wanted to try to be a bit more offensive, um, and and I thought we, you know, in 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 the selection that we made, we we. We probably put an extra attacking player on the pitch, which is what we would like to be at home. And, and yeah, just pleased for the players, really. Pleased that, that particularly second half, found that, that, that rhythm in and flow in our, our performance. And you could, you could sense that, you know, that we finished the game in a really confident place. And that's, that's really positive moving forward. And of course, when you look at the week as a whole, two games and six points, how nice does that sound? Yeah, I think it's been a, been a really good week if you look at performance. Um, I thought a really, really good performance against Oxford, against all the odds. I thought against Burton, we um, we dug deep and we found a way, and, and certainly looked a much, much, much bigger threat um, in terms of, in terms of goal creation in that game uh, today. Yeah, second half I think it's the best we played for a long while, and and you know we we now have a platform to build on. And we said before the game that you win today, you you earn the right to look up, and and, and we've done that today. Many thanks, Danny. Congrats Pleasure. on the win. Thanks, guys.